Cross your fingers. Here we go. I'm scared to place this. Hey guys, Scotty here, back with another episode. How you guys doing? I hope you're having a good day. I'm having a pretty good day, but it's about to get a whole lot better, because you know what we're about to do. We are about to continue building the fl elevator platform. So, before we continue though, um, I gathered up a bunch of more resources with good old Manfred and Dottie. Where'd she go? Oh, she's over there. Um, so we got a refill on the wood here and there and not completely full here but I mean what's a few hundred wood um, so that's all filled with thatch that's all filled with thatch I didn't quite fill up all of the stone I don't think I think that's only that's almost full that's like less than half full that is full though that's barely anything. And that's about halfway full. So, you know, we got maybe four or five chests worth of stone. It, it'll be pretty good. Um, let's see. We already used up... Um, actually, we didn't use very many pillars at all. Um, we did use about half of our stone ceilings. Um, this is what we're going to be needing to make more of, and definitely walls. So, yeah, I'm going to make up about maybe... 200 more walls and probably at least a hundred more ceilings and then I will be right back with you guys alrighty let's see what we got now 271 stone walls 139 ceilings and I made 75 stone door frames now you may be wondering why the door frames am I gonna do something with windows mm, nope nope You'll see. You may have already guessed it. I mean, put two and two together. Um, so let's see. We're going to have to load up Manny. Let's get some of that. Some of that. Well, not, not that many. Um, some more of those. Some more of those. Can I move? No, I can't even move. Oh, crap. Manny, come here. Oh, man. Uh, what's the most? Let's drop that real quick. Can we move now? Yep. Get that. Get that. Pick those back up. And let's bring you a little closer here. Um, let's see. Oh, and walls. Lots of walls. Manny, you are so awesome with your 1640 weight. Just gotta say it. Um, definitely need a lot of stone walls and hmm I think I'm gonna do some expansion as well so let's bring the wood ceilings actually you know what I don't I don't even need the wood I can just use the thatch although I'm not gonna necessarily now let, let's let's leave that for another time um, we'll just use the wood for now oh can't move okay can you move like that I think so let's get on Tirana get you turned around here oh no he's gonna fall Whee! Flash. <laughs> Alrighty. Let's come down over here. Oh, you know what I should have brought? I should have brought some ramps. Because I need to make some way to get up there. I don't know where my ground entrance to this thing is going to be. I mean, theoretically, once I get it all built, I won't ever need to set foot on the ground. But for now, hmm. I guess I'll just keep using that corner right there that I have been. Um, we're, oh, we got the ceilings on us. In fact, you know what? Maybe we can just extend this out a little bit. There we go. Now we can jump up easier. Okay. Let's see here. Oh! Oh, I forgot. I completely forgot. 
I completely forgot. Be right back, you guys. Okay, well, I was supposed to go get polymer, so had to run and do that real quick. Because, okay, I was about to say, where's all my polymer? It's already in my inventory, excellent. So let's stick all that in there, because we are going to build a few more elevator tracks. I think I only have enough to build two more, yeah. So we're going to build each of the three that we need for the three elevators. And hopefully, I think I'll be able to place them without much trouble. Wait, what are we what are we missing to build more? Polymer oh. Oh, for some reason I thought we had a little bit more polymer than that. But never mind. Okay. So got that. We can come back over here. Yep, there's one there. Actually, I'm going to save. I'm going to save the other two just in case this doesn't work. Because I should now be able to uh, remove the wood ceiling here. Cross fingers. Oh, yeah. Awesome. And now, now here is the really awesome part. Let's go grab, let's see, some of that, some of that, and we'll leave those. So you know what I was talking about with the aesthetic? Oh, it's obstructed. Shoot. So I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna have to place this before. How come? No, hold up, hold up here. I know this worked before. Oh. Hmm gonna kind of be a waste of materials I think no oh right there I could do that oh don't scare me like that copy uh, okay I okay I'm not a hundred percent sure but I'm fairly sure I can still place this without the ceiling so well, just to be sure, let's see. Okay, it's right above that brick. Uh, gosh, this, this is going to be a waste of resources no matter what I do. Uh, I hate that. Okay, let's place this. Now can we still play? Oh, good. And I think that's still right like that. I hope that's exactly where where it was, but yeah, this this was the awesome thing that I found out that if you place the stone door frame, you can then place this in between it, and it's so awesome because this is pretty much going to block um, the view of the pillar, and I can just close this off with walls. In fact, let's do that right now. And then, hmm, to keep the wood or not? Uh, I guess we'll we'll do it classic style. There we go. Huh? That doesn't look quite right. I guess it's right. I don't know. But anyway, let's 
It, it look it pretty much. I'm thinking we're gonna have to place all of the stone door frames first before we place the um, elevator track. But I mean, at least we can. Oh, and and oh god, I should have tested something else. Um. Oh well. I mean, if I was gonna say. I should probably test to make sure I can place the, the stone ceiling after that, but I don't know. We'll see. For now, though, I know that I can just get rid of this wood ceiling. Uh, shoot. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Alrighty guys, well, I really wanted to show you the step-by-step -step, um, of what I did exactly, but at this point, after fiddling with it for hours and, well, it wasn't hours, but it was a long time. Um, but yeah, after fiddling with it for that long and finally getting it the way I need it to, I don't, I honestly don't even know how I did it. Um, somehow I, I got the same level of pillar to go over here and stand alone on its own. I don't I don't know if I could replicate that. I probably could eventually, but it was a lot of work. But it's fine because we got them all in the right position. Um, you can see that's right above that, um, that bottom block for the second door frame. And then it is also that way here and then like that for here so we're good um, now the thing is I don't know if I can place the stone ceiling after the fact I'm almost positive I can place it before the fact so I think that's what I'm gonna actually go ahead and do right now is there they are I kinda wanna leave these open just so I can get a better sense of where they are um, or where the platform is going to be, but I don't want to take the chance at not being able to place these. So, and we're out. Or are we? Ha ha ha! Okay, and now I think we're good to place the elevator shafts. I just got to make sure that I place the rest of the door frames before I go up any higher. Cross your fingers. Here we go. I'm scared to place this. And then, yeah, we can place it up like that and so on and so forth. And then like that. And like that. And now I just got to farm a bunch more metal, get a lot more electronics and polymer and make the elevators. That's going to take a long time though. That's that's going to be a little bit into the future. But for right now we got the um, the base tracks and I can start building up the rest of this because we got the stone. So let me um, see what do we got? 90 and only 17 and pillars. I'm, I might expand the platform out a little bit but yep I'm going to go ahead and do that now.
All right, you guys. Well, when I said expand out, I meant up. <laughs> um, also, I'm very sorry. Um, I did record me building all of that. However, it wasn't until later that I'd realized that my hard drive was full. I had been neglecting to keep an eye on how much data was on it, and it couldn't put any new video on it, so I lost a good 20 minutes or more, which is like five minutes in a sped up montage, so sorry about that. Um, but yeah, as you can see, I have built quite a bit more. I've pretty much exhausted all of my available building supplies for now. Um, I do intend to gather more which um, I should have a whole bunch more stuff ready for next episode. Now, the question that I need to figure out is, do I... Eh, never mind. Yeah, I was going to say, do I go ahead and build pillars here um, and just concentrate on getting the elevator shaft done, or do I expand out to have an actual pillar? Because I plan on having this giant building be... Um, where I do most of my breeding and indoor dino storage. I do intend on having a lot of my dinosaurs be stored on these pathways along the rock face here, but I won't be able to fit everything along here. Um, so anything that I want to keep indoors and close by um, is definitely going to be inside this building here. So I got to start constructing it um, pretty soon if I want to actually be able to use it. Um, but for now, I think I'm just going to finish building the the building part of the elevators. Even if I can't build the actual metal um, elevator itself, I can at least build the building around it. And oh, oh, you probably noticed, um, I, I had this great idea for a maintenance crawlway by putting the ladders inside because I don't need this pillar to go all the way up. I just need it right here to determine the height of the original elevator track base. Um, and then this one will provide the basis for all the other elevator tracks. So that leaves this open, and I thought maybe that I would have to build a, um, a trapdoor out here, because my character might, uh, might not be able to fit through there trying to go up a ladder, but it does just fine. And it's really cool, I can go all the way up. So um, until we get the elevators operational, that's how I'm going to be going up and down, um, at least on foot. I mean. Not that I need to, I got my pteranodons. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm going to have this connect out here. I'm going to have to build a lot more pillars because in order to have foundation support, I think I may need, well, this area I might be able to do without, but this over here? Uh-oh, who's fighting? Oh no, Manfred, neutral, kill it! What is it? It's probably a compi. Yep, I knew it. Um, but yeah, this area right here, I can't, I can't go out any farther without having foundation support. So, yeah, um, I'm either going to have a lot of pillars, or you know, I could, I could do a little trickery. Um, as long as you have foundations underneath, you can have any amount of height above it um, be just fine. So, what if I were to put like foundations here underneath the water and have maybe like a little I wouldn't even have to do that actually maybe I could just have the foundations I was thinking about maybe having like a bridge or an archway to make this over like make it a whole giant bridge um, but I wouldn't even necessarily have to do that maybe I could just do foundations I'm gonna play around with that and uh, see if that'll work because I don't want more pillars here it's just gonna be a repeat of the underpass over here and you know what we did with all those pillars. We covered them up, so <laughs> I don't necessarily want to have to do that again. Um, and over here, hmm, I might just have like some kind of room come over here. That way I don't have to do pillars or just random foundations. I can make it look like it's an actual thing and then just have space above it that provides um, well, it's, it's open space, but there's still foundation support, so... Yep, I'm gonna continue doing all that, and you guys can see the outcome of that in the next episode. I can't wait. Like, this this just looks so cool as it is. It's like this gigantic, um, 
platform construction. So yeah, that's going to be it for this episode, guys. Oh, there we are. Hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, hit that like button and uh, subscribe for more videos. And I hope to see you in the next episode. Have a good one.